Hey, uh, t today I thought I'd let you in on what it's like to be in the glorious life of playing in a Lawrence Welk tribute band. Tonight we have a gig in Price, Utah. I'm in Kaysville at my house. And obviously being in a Lawrence Welk tribute band and playing a gig starts out in the morning with, uh, with a minivan, right? So I'm going to take my minivan over to Smith's and I'm going to pick up some pop for the band. And that's what it's like to be in a Lawrence Welk tribute band. This tribute band of Lawrence Welk music I have the honor to play in features many musicians that are far superior in capabilities than me. That means purchasing top quality soda pop for them. So what I did is I opted for this. Uh, this is this Kroger brand soda was on sale. This pop was on sale. Uh, three 12 packs for eight dollars so I'll ensure that they get the top quality pop uh, also a cooler full of ice is important when I opened this cooler unfortunately I found the oldest cheese stick in history so I'll promptly throw this away I think that if I eat this cheese stick I'll probably get some disease and be at least sick and maybe dead before the gig tonight in price so eating this cheese stick is unadvisable, so I'm going to throw it into the garbage. important aspect of being in a Lawrence Welk tribute band is you, you don't forget a couple of things, like you have to have a, so, a sombrero, and if you're going to have a sombrero, then you have to bring a serape as well. These are two essential things that everybody needs if they're going to be in a Lawrence Welk tribute band. If you're going to be in a Lawrence Welk tribute band, you need to have a lot of musicians. So. Here's some musicians right here that I found in this alley. Hey. Do you guys want to be in a Lawrence Welk tribute band today? Oh, is it today? Yeah. Where? Uh, oh, Price, Utah. Sounds pretty good today. So, Brandon, why don't you play the trumpet tonight? Is that all right? I'll try. Aaron, let's put you on trombone. I'd love to try it. You bet. Larry, how about we rent you a grand piano? Okay, that works. Yeah, I'll do that. So, yeah, what are you, you going to play? Uh, I think I'll play the bass guitar and wear a sombrero. <laughs> few musicians, but we need more musicians if we're going to be in a Lawrence Welk tribute band. So, I'm not a musician. Well, I just hit stuff. No, this is this is Keith Moon, and I think we're going to put him on drums today. Is that all right? Sure. Yeah. I haven't played in like 25 years, so. And this this guy here with a beret, what you, you play the flutophone, don't you? Yeah. So bass flutophone. Bass flutophone. But today, can you double on guitar? Why do you just put your hands on a neck and you move your fingers around on it? Is yeah. That what you do? And there's four to eight strings, I think, on it. Yeah, but you got to remember, he only has two fingers on each hand. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Uh, it'll sound cool. Well, just do the best you can. Okay. You have to have lots of stuff to be in a Lawrence Welk tribute band. Here's, like, look at this. So all this stuff that you see here, these are all essentials. Including like you're gonna need you yeah, absolutely you have to have an elephant costume for sure and uh, All this gear a few monkey masks All this stuff you're gonna need sparkly coats fancy shoes All essentials if you're gonna be in a Lawrence Welk tribute band Well tribute band you're gonna need to charter a big bus like this one so this is the bus that's going to take everybody down to Price. I think there's, I'm not even sure, I think there's 25, 26 musicians and people coming along. So we're about to load this bus up. A lot more musicians and singers are here. Just shooting some videos. This is Todd Feeney. He's, he's on Barry Sax and Clarinet. And Todd and I go way, way back. Way back, we played in a band yeah. called Darby O'Gill and the Real People, yeah. and then a band called Funk Toast. So it's good to have him back. Really good, actually. Happy to be here. <laughs> this is this is Rick. I kind of introduced you. He's on tenor sax, and Oz is on bone. Jared Beckstrand, trumpet. This is Ben. 
He's going to take pictures. He's the official photographer. This is our bus driver. This is our bus driver. Sean. <laughs> Sean, He's our a bus driver. lifelong friend of ours now. Yeah, lifelong friend of ours. We've known him for 20 or 30 years. <laughs> That's Larry. He's on piano. This is uh, Kevin. Hey there. How you guys doing? Kevin Hillman on trumpet. Let's see who else we have over here. <laughs> Here's two of the Sparkle sisters. Hello. Why don't you introduce yourselves? I'm Abby Page. Abby Sparkle Page. I'm Marilyn Sparkle Hale. <laughs> We're waiting for the third singer to show up. That's right. You know her? <laughs> yeah, yeah. She's my sister. This is this is Mike Terrell, also known as the Red Top Hat Man. He's a performance artist. And you already met Keith Moon. Magician! Yeah, he's a magician. And he hits stuff. And then, of course, we have Brandon Tucker, who is on Brandon trumpet. Brandon Sparkle Tucker. Yep. And he's arranged a lot of the charts that we're going to play tonight. So that's awesome. So the bus is due to leave in about 10 minutes. We're waiting for the rest of everybody to show up. We are ready to take off. Our bus driver's like, get on the bus. Come on, let's get this thing all going. And he's a huge Lawrence Welk fan. There's everybody. Tons of talent there. It's gonna be fun. Okay, so now we're to the point where we're setting up the stage. It's pretty extensive here. Piano. Percussion. Big bass drum. Schedule, of course, though. Yeah! Champagne music, well, in, in Utah, non alcoholic champagne music <laughs> that we present for you. Who wants more, huh? You gave the monkey the gun! Signatures here. It's gonna be fun. It's a blast. Wish you were here.